What is up everybody? Big Ox Triple Six here, the golf gamer. So check it out, man. I am sorry that I have the dryer running in the freaking background. I apologize. It's just for some fucking reason I always record my videos either on freaking dry my clothes or wash my clothes. <laughs> Every single time. I don't know why I'm doing it. I just, I just forget. This, the background noise and stuff and um my last video that I made I had heard a little bit of stuff um it my, was my refrigerator running so I can't stop that but I am sorry that it's picking the stuff up I apologize but I have to fucking rant I am sorry about this okay everybody heard of Fortnite alright Fortnite's been a big deal for a long freaking time. Huge, huge, huge battle royale game. When it first came out, it wasn't um, a battle royale game. It was just a freaking save the world, a wave after wave of enemies coming at you. Yes, that was Fortnite before it became Fortnite battle, ro battle royale. No bullshit. And the game's been out for a long time and they make up a bunch of new content which I have no problem you know keeping people entertained and stuff but the problem that I have with the um, content is the characters okay so I think it's been about a year or two they start using like um, iconic characters from freaking Star Wars. I know recently, a couple months, they they use some like um, video game characters, freaking Marvel comic heroes. You know, I thought that stuff was cool. But what irks me the most about this, some of them don't know the the character. Recently, they just announced Raven from DC. Raven is well, like one of my favorite characters from DC. She, she's up there with freaking Catwoman, Poison Ivy, um, freaking Batgirl. Not Batwoman, fuck Batwoman. <laughs> Especially the TV show. <laughs> freaking Harley. She's up there with them. Seriously. And some of these kids don't know these iconic characters they, they they literally don't so um lord croft was a recently a re recently announced okay and i saw the trailer for it. i was like oh that's pretty cool i, I like the little trailer and stuff and people were asking who's who's this character where's she come from and there's one guy on twitter saying it's like oh she came from this this game the old school um PlayStation One game, and some of the young kids like no, 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 he isn't. It's she just recently been announced for Fortnite. She's a Fortnite character, and I'm just like, what? The dude actually showed a photo from Wikipedia. Well, that's nothing about Wikipedia. That crap pisses me off. It actually said this character was originally, um, um, originated from freaking Fortnite. And I'm just like, what the fuck? Are, are you are you freaking kidding me? And I'm just like, oh my gosh. Fortnite is ruining these iconic characters. Kratos has been announced on there. Master Chief has been announced. Freaking um Xenomorph, freaking um Alien been announced. Predators on there. You know? And I'm just like. These young kids don't don't really care about these characters. They really don't. I I have noticed this, and it just freaking like irks me that they see this character. Oh, that that character came from Fortnite because he does a floss dance or a freaking whatever dance they fucking do. I I'm not a big fan of Fortnite. All right, I I'm not a big fan of battle royales. I I I never have. I tried Fortnite. I didn't like it. Okay. It's, it's not my cup of tea. I tried a bunch of um, Battle Royale games. 
Heck, I gave, gave you, you guys a freaking code last week of uh, freaking, um, um, well, I don't even fucking know that freaking game. Freaking Player Unknown's Battleground, Battle Royale. Not, not my cup of tea. Um, what other game that came free on PlayStation that I play? H1, H1, H1Z1? What's that at? I don't know. It's like free for PlayStation Plus. I, I wasn't a big fan of it. But anyways, these young kids don't know these characters and don't respect them. When I noticed it, um, when Super Smash Brothers had their um, character announcement, I was trying to try and think what it was. Um, Terry Bo Bogart, all right, when it was announced. And some of them actually said, Hey, check it out. That's Ken with the Ken with the freaking hat. Are you kidding me? Freaking Terry Bogart has been back in Neo Geo days. I remember him playing Terry Bogart from freaking Fatal Fury on Super Nintendo, man. Super Nintendo. I just freaking pre-ordered the the um, Amiibo for it. Didn't want to pay that much for it, to be honest. Just, just saying. I really didn't want to pay that much, but I was like, fuck this. I'm not missing out on freaking Terry Bogart, and I'm not missing out on freaking Banjo Kazooie. It's, it's not fucking happening. It is not. So I got that motherfucker pre order. All right. So it should be coming in, in the mail pretty freaking soon. But they don't respect the characters. I bet I'm not trying to freaking put my friends under a bus or anything like that, but I could, I could probably point out. A few characters because they, they have kids. All right, I could I could probably point out a few characters, iconic characters to them, and they probably won't have one freaking clue about it at all. These these young generations don't don't care about that stuff, man. It just it makes me feel like a freaking boomer, to be honest. It it really does, and it, and it sucks because I grew up with these these characters, and I'm quite fond of them, you know. Iron Man playing freaking Tomb Raider on a PlayStation 1 days. My dad brought Tomb Raider, that first part where the freaking wolves come out and stuff. I thought that crap was scary. Seriously. You know? And I understand Epic Games actually, you know, trying to entertain these kids. I, I know that. They're, they're, they're making their money. I, I'm not, I'm not going to hate on that. They're, they have to freaking update this stuff to keep those these... um people entertain entertain and I was on Twitter talking to um, Smokey Dog, Smokey Dog. I, I follow him on, on YouTube and stuff and he was all saying that people don't like Fortnite because they don't like to play it and I, I respond to him I was like no I don't like freaking Fortnite because these kids don't know who the fuck these iconic characters are they don't, and he's like, they don't smoke. They don't supposed to know everything. I was like, bullshit. Look it up. Ask the fucking parents. That piss, pisses me off too. Like, show show where these freaking characters come from. The parents too. But that's just me, man. It just irritates the fuck out of me. It really does. That freaking Ryu and Chung Li doing the freaking flossing and stuff. I, and they don't know where they freaking came from. It just it just irritates the fuck out of me. I know I'm a hardcore gamer, but it's just these young kids. I just wanna wanna just like <laughs> punch in the face sometimes. I really do, man. Jeez. Uh. But I wanted to have that rant, man. I I understand Epic trying to freaking entertain these kids. I really do. Some of them freaking paying so much money for these freaking skins. And I don't understand. I don't understand it. <laughs> I really don't because eventually all that stuff is going to be completely wasted. I know. I know it's their money, but it's a freaking server. That's that's why I prefer single player games and buy just a DLC for it because I'm getting more content for it. To me, just just a skin on an online game. That server go down within two or three years. 
all that stuff wasted. I know, I know that that could be the same thing with freaking DLC, but some of the DLC that I buy is actually fucking good. But I could be vice versa on that too, with the skin. They could be actually good for them. So I don't know, man. <laughs> Oh, freaking no. <laughs> it just irks the fuck out of me. It really does. I just want to get that rent out of the way. Um, I was going to make a video later on, actually tomorrow, to be honest, because I sort of got something. I'll probably post it up tomorrow because I don't I don't know if the, the item's going to show up on time today because it's supposed to show up at 9 and I'll be freaking still sleeping by then, like 9 uh, p.m. I'll be sleeping, to be honest. Um, but yeah, I'll show you guys probably tomorrow or the next day. We'll see. But um, apparently Kotaku, one of the um, game journalists, writers, or Kotaku try to say like Pokemon Go, the eggs are not considered like loot boxes. And to be honest, I've been playing Pokemon Go. I play Pokemon Go. All right. That's the only thing I, I mostly play on mobile. I really don't play like, you know, any other mobile, mobile game, to be honest. And I never put a dime. <laughs> that's, that's another game. I, I, don't, I don't put any money into it. None. And I've been playing that game for five years. I think I have like a um, Pokecoins, like 1,100 Pokecoins or, or like... No, like, not 1,100, freaking uh, 11,000 Pokecoins. It's been between, like, 11,000 11, or 10,000 Pokecoins. And I have never, ever put a dime in. And there's people I, I, I listen to on podcasts that try to get to level 40 because you have, like, a little special icon if you reach level 40, um, like, I think, like, last year. And the dude's wife on Giant Bombcast actually... Um, Put some money into this game. Into this game. And I'm just like, why? Why? <laughs> I don't understand, man. I don't understand that shit. I really don't. It's just an online game that's going to go off servers and shit. What the fuck? <laughs> but anyways, the writer from Kotaku said the, the eggs that you hatch weren't loot boxes. Which, technically it is because you hatch an egg and you get a random item from it. You could actually pay money, real money, to get these freaking egg incubators and hatch the egg. To me, that is a loot box. But he was trying to say it's optional, which is which it is. You can actually earn the stuff in game, going and freaking set in your certain gems. I have done that multiple times. I've never put any money into this game. But it's still, to me, considered a loot box. Alright? <laughs> I play that mofo every single freaking day. Um, why do I do it? I don't know. It's, it's just freaking a time waster. It really is. That's about it. What, what you can do on, on cell phones. But to me, it's a, it's a mobile game. It's a... It's a, it's a um, crap! I forgot what I was saying. It's a freaking loot box. That's all it is, just in a different way. And I don't approve of loot boxes. I don't. You won't see my black ass paying for one. It's not happening. Never. Because I'm smarter than that. And I know people don't have that 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 willpower and stuff. And I know it sucks because there's a bunch of people buy all these um, random ass loot boxes on a ultimate team from FIFA, Madden, all that crap, which I don't play those those type of games, but some people don't have the willpower to freaking, you know, to stop. And it sucks because that's how they hook you, all the whales and stuff. But I am rambling on I just want to get that rent out, man. I really did. But um I'll be making a video probably either tomorrow or the next day to show you guys what I got and I will have something to give out it's gonna be like a coat and two coats all right that I'm not gonna even freaking use but I was kind of surprised I got something with it because I, I 
bottom movie. I actually enjoyed it. Some people didn't like it, but I fucking enjoyed it. But anyways, I'm out. <laughs> this is Big Ox Triple Six. Y'all stay awesome. Wear your mask. Stay healthy. And watch out for weirdos. I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys. Have a good one.